first one to be an actual watch. The first Mi Band was a revolution. Everyone wore it and totally ignored the other fitness trackers. Will this one become a hit as well? My name is Dmitro Voloshin. Let's predict this. The first Mi Band tracker from Xiaomi was a real breakthrough. It was a real bargain tracker with great build and price and well looking too. There was nothing superfluous, huge battery life and simplicity. Mi Band 1S was a logical evolution successor. It was more precise, more energy efficient and added a much wanted heart rate sensor. Mi Band 2 now is even better. The heart rate sensor and the accelerometer pedometer became even more accurate, the front panel looks much sleeker now, the battery became noticeably larger and there's now a graphic screen on the face of the watch. Let's get into the details though. The weight went up from 5 to 7 grams and the tracker is still very light and gets unnoticeable after some time wearing it. The device capsule itself is 3mm longer and almost unnoticeably wider and higher, which turns out to be a good thing. The band holding it sits on the hand much more snugly, especially on a larger male hand. The original Mi Band straps will not fit the new tracker though, you will have to collect them all again. The whole front is covered with a shiny glazed piece of plastic, with a metal capacitive button with concentric engraving in the bottom. The button doesn't click. The fastening pin on the other side is made in the same way and matches the button. There is a small 0.42 inch black and white OLED screen underneath the plastic. It is well readable in normal light and still visible under the direct sunlight, though you will have to squint to see the info. On the other hand, the blacks on an OLED screen are really deep blacks, so the edges of the screen seamlessly blend into the remainder of the front panel, so the image just seems to appear on the front of the plastic face. Plastic is not perfect when it comes to being scratch resistant, but it is much harder to shatter than glass. Which is more important? Well, it is hard for me to say. What I can say though, this plastic is quite hard to scratch. I wound up rubbing the face of the tracker against painted metal hinge of the door, and to my surprise the tracker had no scratches, so it is well good enough. The button scrolls within the menu options turned on on the smartphone app. You can see the notifications and launch the heart rate sensor autonomously. Inside is a larger 70 mAh battery, Bluetooth 4.0 low energy and the new optical heart rate sensor or the photophotosmograph. The battery size was increased by half. This is so there is enough power for notifications on the screen. The specifications state 20 days of battery life. In real life it lasts 3 to 4 weeks if used reasonably and 2 to 3 weeks if you turn on the precise sleep tracking, additional notifications and use the heart rate sensor a lot. The previous models lasted longer but it doesn't really matter at this point. 3 weeks is more than enough to forget that you even have to charge your tracker. It would be enough even for the longest vacation and you wouldn't have to bring the charger with you. The heart rate monitor becomes more precise. Its results are now closer to my full-size chest monitor, about 6 to 10% difference maximum. The Mi Band 2 uses the heart rate sensor to tell if the band is on the hand or not, minimizing the false step and sleep measures. Mi Band 1S also had this. The vibration became much more substantial. The notifications and the smart alarm are now even harder to miss or ignore. You can choose what will be displayed on the tracker's screen in the smartphone app. By default there is the time and the heart rate measurement and indication. You can add the pedometer reading, the distance traveled, calories spent and the battery charge remaining. The clock, heart rate measuring and the pedometer can work autonomously without the smartphone connection. The heart rate can be measured right from the band by simply getting to that menu item by tapping on the main button. The result will be then updated to the Mi Fit app. The clock continues to count time with no connection to the phone as well, making this a full-fledged watch. By vibrating and displaying corresponding icon on its screen, the tracker can notify you about an incoming call, a message, notification from one of three additional chosen apps on the phone, the alert of achieving the daily goal and an hourly reminder to get up and move a bit after sitting for 45 minutes.